Bye, baby. Bye, baby. Hey guys, welcome back to Count It All Joy. So in today's video, it's actually probably gonna be a two day vlog I'm gonna be doing. Gabby is going to the vet today to have her heartworm treatment. And so we have to leave her overnight for that. We're all a little bit anxious about it. So please be thinking about Gabby and just praying that everything goes good with her. But I think I'm gonna make this just a two day vlog so I can show you guys dropping her off this morning and then also picking her up tomorrow and letting you know how all that went. So come along in the video and we'll also maybe just kind of hang out with the rest of the animals on the homestead today. You guys tell them her bye bye. Yeah. Sit Gabs. She says, what's going on? Hello Gabber. She's been feeling fine, but we definitely want to follow through with all the treatment that they recommend. So she's had her oral medicine and today she has to go in and they're going to give her, um, like, um, one, I guess it's, I don't know if it's a shot or like IV medicine, give her that today and she stays all night and then they give it to her tomorrow. Sit baby. Sit. Did you put a towel or anything? A blanket. Oh my, oh, big girl. <laughs> big girls. Honey, honey, honey. She doesn't go for rides that much. Well, mother truck I didn't care, but this truck. Well, but she yeah. also just kind of gets so scared. She, she'll jump over there if I don't. It's okay, sweetheart. You just going to the doctor for a little it's bit, okay. okay? It's okay. You get to ride with daddy. Okay. You get to ride with daddy. All right. You just gonna hold on to her? Yeah, she'll get up there. Okay. Get up there, honey. Get up there. Get up there. She's fine. She will. Okay. Are you confused? Sit down. Sit. There you go. Good girl. Sit, Gabs. Get up there. Turn oh. around, baby. Turn my, turn my shutter hair everywhere. Good there girl. Go. Sit down. Sit. She will. She will once I start Gabs. Okay, Gabby, you and Daddy get us some footage of your little trip. See ya. See you tomorrow, baby. Love you. Be good girl, okay? Bye, baby. Bye, baby. It's okay, Grace. She's wondering where we took her mama. She'll be back tomorrow, okay? We'll let you out when we get home. Gabby. Hi, baby. Gabs. Gabs. Gabby. She's worried because they're in the store. She's watching for me. If my voice sounds like I'm stopped up and sick, I am. Hi, Gabs. There, Gabby. Watch. She'll drop it and then try to eat it. Wait, that's the first time you didn't do it. A little pre-snack, a little vet pre-snack. You ready to go? Probably don't, are you? Probably don't know what's going on. You got her? Yeah. She'll jump down. Okay, do it's kind of high, though. I know. Here, come down to this one. Baby. Baby. Oh, okay. Nice little jump. Yeah, she'll jump. Oh, uh -oh. You got her? See you, Gabby. Oh Bye, Gabby. Gabs, hold on. Good girl. Hold on. She gets so nervous. Okay. Gabby. She's too strong. Come on. Gabby. She's not a little strong. Well, how'd she do? She's scared. If you saw her on the leash, she didn't want to go in. But we weighed her for the treatment. She weighs 79. I don't remember what she weighed About that. last time. 
Um, but she's done really good there. She hasn't had any symptoms, like I was saying earlier, but we just had to follow through with this. It's just an injection, they said. But like if they give it to her at nine o'clock this morning, then she'll get it exactly the same time tomorrow at nine. So I think it's more that, that they wanna make sure people are doing, you know, that she gets it right at the exact same time the very next day. So they'll just see how she does today and then tomorrow she'll get the same thing and then we can pick her up. We pick her up tomorrow sometime? Yeah, tomorrow morning if as, as long as everything goes good with her. Right. So she's you said they you said they put her to sleep or No, they just no, they just give her the injection and I know that they're watching for like side effects, but it sounds like that's not really the main thing. It's just that she has to get it exactly the same time the uh, next day. All right. So probably if they send it home with a lot of people, they probably wouldn't give it the exact same time that makes sense and they have food in here for so she might be excited for that we'll see yeah so as you guys probably see in all the videos gabby and gracie are like inseparable so i feel like gracie's gonna be just a little off the next couple of days not knowing where her mama is grace gracie it's okay so I'm give gracie some extra loving today um Randy the carpenter's here to work and his dog Nay and Gracie don't get along that great so we're gonna leave Gracie in her pen for a little bit this morning. Gracie I'm gonna go feed everyone okay? I'll come back and check on you in a little bit okay? All right so now that we got Gabby dropped off we checked in on Gracie I'm gonna go around and feed everyone this morning. Good morning Gunner. Hi, baby. Hey, I'm gonna have to let you out later, okay? Cause I gotta go do a meeting in just a little bit. Yeah, we got a meeting about the expo. So let's give you some food this morning, Gunner. Hold on, Bubba. Hold on, Bubba. I gotta scoop it out. Oh, we need some more food. Growing baby, he eats a lot. When I go pick the girls up from school, I'll get you some more food. He has like pretty much just enough for this morning feeding. He has just enough for his breakfast. There you go, sweetie. There you go. Eat your breakfast, okay? Can't stay long. You hear Pearl and Percy hollering at me again. Oh my goodness. They're so loud and demanding. Hey, why are you scratching and itching? You have flea and tick medicine. There's something itching you. You've already had your flea and tick medicine. Yes, you have. Oh, sweet baby. I'm going to go feed the piggies. Eat your breakfast. Eat your breakfast. I'm coming, you two. Percy, are you walking okay? So I had started a video, um, maybe like three or four days ago that I was going to try to share with you guys about Percy. He had kind of been limping a little bit and Dutch and I tried to trim up his toenail some more. That's a whole challenge in and of itself, but I was seeing if maybe that's what was going on. Dutch thought maybe he just like twisted his little ankle, but he seems to be walking better. I still see kind of like a slight little limp. But um, if you notice anything with them, that's what's going on there. They stick their noses in the way, and then I can't get all of their food in their bowl. You are drooling up a storm, ma'am. This time when we filled up their feed, Dutch wanted to throw them some corn in there, give them a little bit different something. So, they did kind of a little mix. I think they've been enjoying that. I'm sure, it's kind of like candy to them. Okay, let's go check on Chief and Eddie. Bye, babies. Good morning, boys. I see that you left your feet, your hay feeder alone by the fence for me. Thank you. So, I'm just going to. Well, I might have to cut. I'm going to have to put you guys down for a minute. I have to cut this hay bale. All right, boys. Come on. Come on. Sorry, I got some in your water. They move this hay feeder every day. 
<clears throat> but at least it's kind of close to the fence. I'll give you guys a little half scoop of oats over there if you want some of that in a little bit. Pretty boys. They're probably like in the cooler weather like everyone else is. If I sound a little stuffy and under the weather, I am. But I'm feeling a lot better than I was. Hi, Millie. Okay, boys, I'm going to go give you a little bit of oats. You can check that out later. Okay, so as I say, check it out later, they're like, no, thank you. We'll check it out this morning. They like the oats. So they're like, we'll save the hay for later. They're going to eat their favorite first. I'll give you guys a little bit. Chiefy, come here. It's funny, their personalities, it's kind of like Pearl and Percy. Percy's the more dominant one over there. Chief's the more dominant one over here. So, they just kind of learn that Eddie and Per, um, Eddie and Pearl just kind of learn, hey, they're going to get their way, so I might as well just fall in line. Chiefy, you're dirty. All right, let's go let the chickens out. We usually let the chickens out first thing in the morning, but this morning was a little off because we were dealing with Gabby. Come on, ladies and gentlemen. Our one gentleman over here. I hear you, Dallas. Okay, come on out. Come on out, lady. Come on. I need to get some bedding put in here. I have some over on the porch. I'll throw some scratch out for you guys in a little bit. Okay, let's go let out our other little flock over here. So, I don't know if I've mentioned on my video, there's kind of been sneak peeks of them <clears throat> on Facebook and different things. But we have our original turkeys, Trudy, and then we are going to let you guys know what we decided to name the second one. But now we have a third turkey that our neighbor gave us. Dutch has been calling him Thanksgiving because he hasn't been the nicest, so we think we might eat him for Thanksgiving. But, um, no, sir, no, no, sir. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Hold on, no. No. I'm like a little collie. I don't know what it is, but I get a little skittish of them when he's running straight at me. I was gonna clean out their water, but... Oh my goodness. Wow, okay. Everyone's just letting their wings go this morning. Dallas, wow. Wow. Dallas, what are you doing? Okay, let me dump this water. I try not to freak out when that turkey comes after me, but... Oh, they're finding some corn that Dutch threw out yesterday. Okay, I'm going to try to sneak this water on without him chasing me down. I really don't know... Uh, 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 no. I really don't know that he's after me. I think he just knows people equal feeding and food, but I don't know. I still don't like how he just comes charging after me. Dutch thinks it's hilarious. I do not. Okay, let's rinse out this water. This is pretty much where... Ah, 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 ah! No! 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 You're driving me crazy. I'm just trying to water. Golly. Okay, so I don't know what I'm going to show you of that mess of me screaming over a turkey. I'm literally just trying to rinse out their little water tub. Oh, he's coming again. Yeah, get back. Get back. Here we 
should get them some feed. Oh, no, 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 no. They're over there enjoying the corn scraps from yesterday. Dallas. Water up so. Just off to the races this morning. All right. Well, that's it for me for this morning. I'll check back with you guys later on. Yay! Gabby! Sure, I want it. Hi, baby. Hi, honey. There, come here. Come here. No, no, no. There you go. Good girl. I'm crying. Did you do I'm a good job? There. It's okay. <laughs> hey, come here. Gabby, come here. Hi, baby. I want to go home. Good girl. I want to go home. Hey, sissy. We missed you. It's okay. Daddy's coming back. He has to go pay. Hi, Zipper. You're okay. Tell everyone thank you for praying for you and thinking about you. Gabby, did you do good? Come here, baby. Come here. Oh, now she's back there in the back seat. Hi, sugar. You're a good girl. You ready to go home? Are you, are you ready to go home? Good girl. We missed you. Can I have a kissy? Oh, no, 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 honey. No, you can't climb up here. Daddy will be back in just a minute, okay? There he comes. There he comes. She's crying. Well, there's the total Are you thing. crying after I'm you crying got that? After that bill. Gabby. Gabby, you okay? Did they say what's the next step? She didn't say nothing. Oh, well, I I'm thought probably, that was it. I'll probably have to call him. Oh. Gabby. We're going home, Gabs. Gracie, been missing her. Are you home, baby? Come on, let's go see Gracie. Hi. Are you smiling because we're home? Come on, let's go see Gracie. Come on, Gabs. Gabby. Come on, Gabby. Let's go let Gracie come see her mama. Come on, Gabs. Gabby. Gracie, come here. Gracie, look who's here. Look. Look, Mama's here. Oh, did you not get to go potty at the vet? Lily, leave her alone. Come on, Gabs. Come on. Yeah. Are you excited, Grace? Be careful. Oh. She's giving you kisses, Gabs. Come on. Okay. The little reunion. Gabby was like, oh dear. Back to motherhood. Man, 
honey. You didn't get to pee the whole time you were there. Gracie, are you glad she's home? Gracie hadn't ever spent a night by herself. So here's Gabby resting. She's been hanging out in here in the living room on a blanket. We've got a fan on her. She has her water over there. Hi, baby. She just seems like she can't really get comfortable. Is your belly hurt, honey? Your belly hurt? didn't know. But I've been looking up stuff, and it's just that it's hard on their body when um, they're getting rid of the heartworms because the whole thing is it kills them and then their body has to pass them through like their vascular system, you know? So, so the heartworms, there's not an easy way for the, their body to get rid of them. So, and also I was looking up stuff that said the medication they get, like the injections, it can make her just feel, you know, kind of sore and yucky for a few days. And there's a pesky little fly that keeps bothering her. She'll bite at it every now and then. Gabby, are you okay, baby? But yeah, we've just been trying to have her rest today. And I'll tell you guys some more about that um, when I get out in the car to pick the girls up from school. Gabs. Gabs. Okay, she's just going to rest for now. She'll say hi later. Pretty baby. Mom will be back in a little bit, okay? Sissies are going to be excited to see you. I'll be back, okay, sweetheart? All right, so it was time for me to come pick up the girls. Thankfully, Dutch got home from the creek property right before I left, so he's sitting there with Gabby. I just didn't really want to leave her by herself this first afternoon, just see how she's doing. Um, so thank you guys so much for checking on her. I know a lot of people commented and shared and everything on Facebook seeing how she was doing. Um, she does seem to be kind of uncomfortable right now. Everything I've looked up says that, um, you know, it's like an injection just like any other thing like that. And she could kind of have some soreness. Also, her body is having to rid itself of the heartworms. And so how that happens is... Um, the medicine that they give her, the injection they give her, kills the heartworms. And then over days and weeks, her body has to break those down in her vascular system um, for her body to be rid of them. So it's not an easy process to get rid of them. It is hard on their body. And so it's expected to, for her to be a little tired and, you know, just not quite herself right now. Um, one thing I was um, kind of worried about earlier, though, was... So Dutch went in and got her for me because she's a little hard on the leash. She gets nervous, and so she kind of fights that, and it's just hard for me to handle her. So he went in to pick her up, and he took her on the leash. They handed her over, you know, um, had him pay the bill, and that was it. Well, when he got in the vehicle, I think I even showed on the video earlier, I was like, what did they say, like, the next step is? And he's like, oh, they didn't say anything. They just gave her to me and took the money, and that was it. So I went ahead and called because I knew that I had remembered there were some other steps kind of to the process. So thankfully I called because when I called, they said um, she would just be retested in six months. But then they included, oh, and she's not supposed to be active at all um, right now. And I said, oh, okay, like for how long? Because I had already let her out of the vehicle and let her and Gracie, sorry, I'm pulling up in the, uh, I'm pulling up in line here. But I said, okay, so how long is that supposed to last? And she said for a month after this injection. So that I had no idea about. Now that I look up stuff, it's actually really scary because if they're very active, they can break off large pieces of those worms and it can be deadly to them. So it can cause like a stroke or death. So that scared me. So I've been watching her like a hawk because once we got home, like I didn't know like any of that was supposed to be, you know, that she was supposed to take it easy or whatever. And so we let her go say hi to Gracie. And I just planned on leaving her out just like we have, you know, always since we've lived out at this property. 
So now that I got that information, it's not a big deal. I just wish I would have known because now we have her in the house. I have her on a blanket and she has a water by her. And so we're going to definitely just be watching watching her super close and she's only going to be going out to go to the bathroom with us. We're not going to let Gracie um, get around her because she gets her riled up and they get a little, you know, playful with each other and everything. So once again, thank you guys so much for thinking of us and thinking of Gabby. Um, I'll keep you updated for sure if anything changes with her and hope to see you guys on the next one. Bye.